Hello friends, welcome back to our kitchen. So today we have a quick breakfast recipe with Irish potatoes, some spinach and a chickpea stew. And to our ingredients, we will have a bunch or a handful of spinach. These are roughly 15 leaves. Here we have Irish potatoes, you can use sweet potatoes. Here I have one cup of boiled chickpeas, you can use beans or lentils. I have one avocado, um, two red onions, one medium sized tomato, one carrot. These are things we'll use, carrot we'll use it for the chickpeas, one onion for the chickpeas and one onion for the spinach. The tomato is for the potatoes. And to our seasonings, we have paprika, cumin, and Himalayan salt, which we use to make the potatoes. And here we have some cumin, turmeric, garlic powder, and Himalayan salt for the chickpeas. And here aside, we have some oil, which we'll, we'll divide it into three. It's just a tablespoon of oil and Himalayan salt for the spinach. And basically, that's all we need. So we'll begin by washing the things that need to be washed and chop. And in a snap of a finger, we did all this. We washed the tomatoes and chopped them into biteable pieces. We sliced the onions for the spinach and diced the onions for the chickpeas. Tomatoes for the potatoes. Carrots we grind, um, grated for the chickpeas. And there are our seasonings and the avocado. So in a pan, I began with some oil, one sliced onion, and the Himalayan salt. We'll begin with the spinach. And it's a matter of sauteing this. It will take you roughly four minutes, a matter of stirring because with time it will shrink in size and it will be ready. I'm doing this on a medium, a medium heat, not too high and not too low. It's just on the average. So in after like four minutes, just close to five minutes, the spinach will have shrunk and this will be ready. And I'll empty it to a bowl and begin with uh, um, the diced onion the seasonings for the chickpeas i'll be adding um, a spoon of my chickpea water which i used to boil the chickpeas and here also i'll add some oil because i'm using carrot carrot is a um, contains vitamin a which is a fat soluble vitamin so yeah I've added the carrots and the chickpeas. It's a matter of stirring. We want the seasonings to blend into the carrot and the chickpeas and for them to be hot enough to be consumed. And once it has reached your desired um, level of cooking, you're just ready to serve it. So we'll take this and Put it to our bowl and empty the ingredients and now to our potatoes very quick i've added the oil that was remaining and the seasonings and some little chickpea water um i'm sauteing this this takes a short time for the tomatoes to mash uh, up Mm -hmm. So I'll later add the potatoes um, and then the remaining chickpea water that we had um, after boiling the chickpeas I've added there and this is the water I'll use to cook the potatoes. So I'm just stirring to mix the um, seasonings well with the water and the potatoes. Then at this point I'll cover for close to 10 minutes or until the potatoes are fork tender as you can see here this is after 10 minutes 
I took my fork and pierced uh, one of the potatoes and guys it went through very well depends on the level of heat and I realized um, the water had gone down but it was just okay if you want it soupy you can just add some water and cook it a little bit more but ensure the potatoes do not become mushy guys we want things that are whole things that look appetizing to the eyes so my avocado messed me up i was so sad about it but anyways um you can always do without it so i decided to eat it like this here we have a balanced diet of potatoes which are carbohydrates our spinach which are vitamins and our proteins from the chickpeas so remember when you're eating this eat this to the glory of god um remember to be a channel of light wherever the lord has placed you he depends on you if you like this recipe please give it a thumbs up and if you're new here do subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified whenever we upload a new recipe have a blessed week bye